so I can send it to the management and see how much stuff he needs to deal with. <laughs> Just gonna start the video from here. Is it yeah. okay if I get you? I would, yeah, I guess. I mean, I'm pissed off about it because they know what it is and they've seen it repeatedly, so. That's all the stuff from the closet. That's over 20 grand in clothing. Uh, coat rack. Metal rack, multi tier rack, um, the bed, Where two mattresses. Well, dude, like, I mean, it started here, right? In that corner over there. It was here along the beam and then over there. Two feet, then inside the closet, the electrical has some moisture as well. Okay, yeah, that's all. I'm gonna send a report to them and then they see what they're gonna do. <laughs> the same thing they've done for three years. Nothing. <laughs> it's the first time here. So oh, I know. It's nothing to do with you I guys, man. No You're the trade. I, I used on. to have the same thing. I would show up with my tools ready to do whatever, and if I couldn't do it, I couldn't. I get paid by the hour, right? So, same with you guys. I hope you're getting overtime. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, then. Okay, we'll see you hopefully when uh, they remove all um, the stuff and they find you, find you a place for the next seven days because it's going to take seven days. Really? The whole process. So, once we cut the drywall, the machines will stay here for three days. Oh, wow. Then, after three days, we come and do the drywall, which is going to take two days. Let's say five days for the repairs, but the lady is seven. So, okay. the, the whole process will take seven days. Thanks for being here. Because after right? uh, the repairs, then we're going to have to do the popcorn and everything back. So, it's going to take two well, more days. Well, it's just a spray machine. I know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? Damn, okay. While you're in here, you might as well do that, too. Which one? So. Oh, the, the, the tape over there? No, the, dude. The corner bit? Can you see that crack running yeah, yeah, from the yeah. side plate all the way? Yeah. And then over here Might is where well the leak was. Yeah. No, no, no. It's other mission. They haven't told you there's an order for this, right? No. <laughs> there's an inspection order from the city of Toronto to fix all this. I have no idea. <laughs> and it started to, I know, but it started to flood today. And two days ago, they issued the order for all this cracking here. There's a twist that you probably didn't see in the beam that's over there. Yeah, like yeah, just yeah. underneath the corner. You well, that's going to be repaired for sure. Behind this, there's a box that's coming out from the studding. The studding's coming out from behind the wall there, too. Like, it's a huge one. I know. So, if you're supposed to be in here and you're going to move the stuff. Well, yeah, yeah. Would it be you guys? It's you guys that do all the drywalling or whatever? Yeah, the work, yes. The repairs, yes. And the remediation, the mitigation water damage. They should be, they should be getting you. Probably. We'll see what happens. Well, yeah, let's see what happens. Just keep those buckets in here. There's no more leak upstairs. Whatever well, is no, on the, the ceiling Well, no, the water fixed it there. Yeah, it's in the, the ceiling. So, yeah, it's in the ceiling. <laughs> oh, Jesus. And hopefully they uh, gonna do find sleep sideways tonight, I guess. a solution for the next two days so we can be back no more than late, like Saturday, I would say, so we can start on this project. Sure. Okay, <laughs> okay. thank you then. Thanks for, Have a nice guys, day. thanks for being straight up. Man. Yeah, absolutely. The other guys, okay. we're not so straight up. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Cheers, man.